<laughs> Welcome back. Kim Gallas, friend of the show, she's a local registered dietitian. She taught us some delicious New Year's Eve dishes yeah. using pork earlier in the show. But get this, now she's teaching us how it might bring us some good luck in the new year. Yeah, and help us to eat more nutritiously as well. Yes. Hi, Kim. Hi, Hi Kim. good to see you both again. And thank you for trying my appetizers and party foods. I have some things for the new year that I hope will help you meet your resolutions okay. and your goals. I love you it. You know, here's the deal. So many people say, I want to lose weight. I want to eat healthier. Right. What does that mean? Yeah. I don't know. There's nothing specific or actionable. So as a dietitian, I say, be specific and say something. So I start Ooh, yeah. with, how about say, I will eat breakfast every day. Nice. And it can be within a couple of hours after getting up. It doesn't have to be immediately. Right. Yeah. But the other thing, you're going to eat breakfast because it sets the stage to keep you full and satisfied before lunch okay. so that you're not mindlessly eating too many calories. Yeah. So it can That's help so with weight true. loss. Okay. Okay. Yes. And so with this breakfast, the other thing I want you to do is with every meal, especially breakfast, 20 to 30 grams of protein all right. because that present, prevents age-related muscle loss. Okay. okay. We all oh, start to yeah. lose muscle as we age. Mm -hmm. So I have my breakfast sandwich. Now, do you guys like those drive through breakfast sandwiches? I, uh, yeah, yeah, I, 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 I do. I do I too. Do. Yeah. But yeah. if you like the ones with bacon and sausage, yep. those would be a little bit higher fat and a little bit higher calories. Okay. So I say use the two pork items that are extremely lean and low fat but high in protein, Canadian bacon and ham. Okay. okay. So I've got my muffin sandwich with cheese, egg, Canadian bacon and whole grain English muffin Love the whole grain. because there's oh, yeah. no excuse for not getting more whole grains and yeah. this sandwich has 22 grams of protein That's great voila oh wow and I have to have peas in the morning it's my favorite vegetable wait to have. what peas yeah frozen peas Oh, it yeah, is? It's very British. I didn't yeah. know that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't know that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, That's new to me, too. That's what the Brits do. The but here's the morning. Okay. It's a way to get a vegetable first thing, and it can be anything you like. Yeah. So start the day off right. Okay. Let's talk about this one. This looks absolutely fantastic. All right. Well, would you like a little bit more of my triple cherry sauce mm. on this pork tenderloin? Mm, yes. I have cooked this pork tenderloin in the oven at 425, but before I did, I actually put a cocoa chili pepper rub on it. Okay. So oh, it's a ton of spices mixed together with cocoa powder, powder and uh, brown sugar and all kinds of chili powder, cumin, ancho chili powder. And then there's the triple cherry sauce that you make on the stove top. It's ready oh, in 15 you know, minutes. That's gonna be good. And here's the deal. My goal for showing you this one oh, sure. I'll get, I'll get is not there. just to say pork tenderloin is extremely lean and low fat, less than three grams of fat in a three ounce serving, which is like the deck of cards. That's great. And it's good for cardiac diets yeah. and it's good for weight loss. A uh, three mm. ounce serving only has 120 calories. That's delicious. The really? on it is great too. Oh, I love Fantastic. this. And this is a great mm. way to eat more fruits because I've used all forms. Yeah. When it comes to fruits and vegetables for your goal this year to eat more fruits and veggies, yeah. Just remember all forms count, not just fresh, fresh, fresh. Okay. So mm. I've got 100% tart cherry juice, canned cherries, and dried cherries. All of these count as a nutrient-rich choice to eat more fruit. Great. Let's talk about vegetables over Ah, here. this is yeah. a nutrient-rich way to eat more veggies okay. because all forms count. I have frozen onions. I have canned pinto beans, canned corn, and yes, corn is a veggie. So if your kids love corn, oh, yeah. Yeah. please serve them corn. And here's the deal. We want to do some good luck in the new year. So I substituted black eyed peas for those black beans All in right. this. So that brings you good luck? Because black eyed peas, you know, are traditional good luck. But a lot of people don't realize that pork in and of itself is a good luck food. Do you uh, like that great. one? So tons of veggies in that for mm. the kids, along with that lean ground pork, Fantastic. no more than 10 grams of protein. Thank you. These are so easy this to make, so Ryan. Good. It's yeah. like you just make them on the stove top and they're ready in 10 to 15 yeah. minutes. Mm. Okay? That's great. And then you serve any kind of taco shell you want, but of course, I'm all about the whole grain. Whole grain. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. let's try to do those whole wheat flour tortillas if you can. Okay. Oh, Kim, this That's is fantastic. awesome. Thank if people you. want to follow along and, and get all these recipes, what's the best way to do it? Well, they can go to Fork More Pork, or they can go to KimGallias.com, or they can go to Fox 59 to the Indie Now website and get these recipes, right? Thanks, Kim, this Kim. was all great. Man, this Thank you. Great. Thank so you. Much. Happy New Year to you all of you. Thank New you so much. Great recipe ideas. Coming up, we're going to introduce you to a talented local visual artist, Andre Parnell, and tell you how you can actually see his work today downtown. Stick around, friends. We'll be right back. Oh, my gosh. I'm a rocket man. Burning out his